Hello and welcome, my name is Sunshine, the project manager of Sunshine Resources. Welcome to our tutorial series on how to build websites with HTML and CSS. And this is tutorial 26th in the series. In the last tutorial, we talked about how to, how to style a link, how you can style the different states of a link. Today, we're going to be styling an unordered list. In the previous videos, we learned how to create put ordered and unordered list. Today we're going to learn how to style an unordered list. So in the body of the script, let's write the, let's make a list, an unordered list first before we go into styling. So let's create the list. For example, I hope you still remember the list tag is UL, opening tag, close it. Okay, now let's create the list now. The list item, let's say, let's say man. Let's copy this and paste it, paste it here again, paste it. Let's correct it properly. Okay, we have here, let's leave that man here. Let's change it to woman. Here, let's change it to boy. And here, let's change it to girl. Let's correct this one here. So this is an unordered list. And now let's save and refresh to see what we've done. Okay, um, the third one is not correct. Let's, let's, the third one is not correct. Let's do it well. So let's see if I refresh now. All right, we've corrected the third one. So this is an unordered list, man, woman, boy, and girl. The browser had bulleted for us. Now, what we are going to do today is that what if you want your own kind of bullet? You want to, um, the browser has this bullet for us. What if you have your own kind of bullet? You want to bullet it the way you want it. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can do that. Now, in your CSS section, just go to your CSS section by the head and then you write this tag here. First, you write UL parentheses open and you write list dash style dash type and colon maybe we want square maybe we want a square instead of just an ordinary bullet okay let's write a square semicolon and you close the parentheses now let's save and refresh to see what we have done okay before i i click the refresh page now let me show you this bullet if you observe it very carefully they are round they're just like dots points okay but let me refresh now okay i need you to observe it very carefully these bullets are now square they are square okay so this is how you can change um the effect around your list item on on the web page this is how you can change the effect on the list item on your web page so that is all we have for you today thank you very much for watching and god bless you